This tutorial will give a broad overview in the steps of working up a patient in the operatory. Each of the forms we're looking at in this tutorial will be covered in much greater detail in other tutorials in this series. Once in the operatory with the patient, first step in the TDO flow is to go to the medical history summary. It is important to review the entries entered by the patient to confirm that everything is correct. Next, go to the pain history. As with the medical history, it is again important to review that everything that has been recorded is factual, and at this point you can clear up any inconsistencies. The next step in the flow is to go to the diagnosis page. At this point, you are just going to conduct a general soft tissue exam, and this includes oral cancer screening, lymphadenopathy, and muscle masti mastication. Later on, we will do a much more detailed examination. The next step in the TDO flow is to do your quadrant testing on the multi-tooth info page. On this page, you will record the results of the testing of the quadrant you are looking at. Once the testing has been completed and you have come up with a diagnosis, it is time to go to the case presentation page. This is a fabulous page to act as a safety checklist. This avoids anything that may have been overlooked and not completed. For example, if the informed consent had not been signed and reviewed, that can be completed at this time. If the pulse or perio probings have not been recorded, you can use the button here to enter that information. Any discrepancies in needed documentation should be addressed at this time. Also remember that your testing results are always available on this page by clicking the testing button. Finally, at the bottom of this page, you can notate whether the case has been accepted, pending, or rejected. The next tutorial in the series will review the medical history in greater detail.